Well, hello again, human beings from the planet Earth. You know, I didn't plan on doing a video this late at night. It's been a long day, but then I was on Twitter, and this tweet came up from a guy that I've interacted with uh, for about a year or more. I actually spoke with him on live radio shows. He's called in all the way from Belgium. Jeremy, that you'll see here. Uh, and we had chatted, as you see. I responded to him telling him I stopped doing radio and uh, was focusing on YouTube and gave him a link to my latest video and responded with this. More and more discovering Alex Jones and his crew are frauds. This is what I've been trying to tell people. Now, maybe sometimes I'm so angry at the things that are going on in the world, it seems attacking. But... I'm adding up the dots. This isn't a personal attack. This is, you know, there's a reason the Planet X research team um, asked me to use this badge on my work and on my web page or wherever I may. It's controlled opposition, people. Listen, I have a marketing background as well and some experience uh, in psychological games, you might say. Um, he gives you enough, Alex Jones gives you enough truth to keep you locked in. And for those of you that are asleep because his, of his pounding of his chest and all the other drama he adds to the content, <coughs> it does wake you up. Okay. But all, not all the way. It's like sleepwalking. Okay. You're walking, but you're not actually awake. Okay. And it's controlled opposition. I'm telling you, and people are waking up about it. If I'll just give you an, for example, if Alex Jones is this big hero with all these, you know, millions of people that back him and support him, then why did most of the videos that I'm seeing of the Bilderberg conference, like maybe 50 or 100 people, there should have been thousands here, right? Have you seen any of the videos with Alex Jones trying to instigate violence almost at gun shows? Uh, when there was absolutely no need to at all. you got to look past it, folks. Now, it gives you some good, hard information, but I guarantee you if you did a little bit of your own research, you'd get that same information fully explained without the Hollywood drama. And I wanted to make note of this. Whenever you have an opportunity to poke the bear, and you poke him. So I'm poking you, Alex Jones. We got our eyes on you, and more and more people are waking up right here. And this man I've communicated with for over a year. He knows me. He kn I know him. Uh, he loves tennis. And from Belgium, again, uh, exact age, I don't know. doesn't matter to me. Jeremy. And uh, he also likes house techno-type music. Ask him. Go ahead. Link to his Twitter will be below. Much love. Many thanks for the views, the shares. And uh, thank you, Jeremy. Uh, for letting me in. I know a year ago when I was talking to Jeremy uh, at least once a week probably on the radio. I was doing the late shows at a certain radio station I won't mention anymore. Um, but anyhow, uh, he, he has good information and, and he's awake to what's going on. He really is. He's a great guy and he interacts. And uh, anyway, give him a follow and, uh, you know, watch some Alex Jones stuff but look for the things I'm saying without taking a personal attack. I mean, there's a lot I can say about it personality, but I'm not here for that. Not here for that at all. Much love. Many thanks. See you soon.